Tomatoes top 10 bitch motherfucker series Yum. Hello motherfuckers, how are you today? I am fantastic. I am here with a new top 10 video. I know I haven't made one in forever, but I thought I want to make one today. And it's all about YouTube. To be honest, it has actually changed my life. Like, it is literally my job. It is my hobby. It's like so fun to me. I love it so much. And I love being a YouTuber. So today, I thought that I would share my top 10 tips on how to become a YouTuber. Because everyone has been asking me for years, do you have any advice on starting a channel? And now I finally feel like I have some experience and I'm ready. <laughs> Give me a moment. I'm ready, bitches. Give us a thumbs up if you're excited to hear all this informational shit. And this is like actual tips, I'm just saying. This ain't a joking video, even though I'm always gonna make a vagina joke somewhere. Let's dive right into the YouTube the JJ. Tip one, always be yourself. Y'all, when I started YouTube, I was so awkward and so insecure and so shy and just so icky. And honestly, it made the first couple years of my videos really awkward. It just didn't turn out well because I wasn't being myself. So always try to be yourself. If you're gay, straight, boring, funny, crazy, anything, whatever you are, just be yourself unless if you're an ex murderer, then go to prison. Tip two is the camera. Honestly, you should buy like an $1,000 DSLR. <laughs> I'm just kidding you guys, of course you don't need that. All you need is like either an iPhone camera or like a webcam. It's all good as long as you can hear you and see you. It's all good, you don't need anything expensive. It isn't about the camera quality. I know that a lot of people say, people are gonna subscribe to you if you have shitty quality videos. Shut the fuck up, bitch. Use whatever you got. Tip three is editing. Personally, I use iMovie most of the time, unless it's like a more complex video than I use Final Cut Pro but I use iMovie most of the time which is a free Mac editing software and so like if you have a Mac or even like an iPhone or an iPad you can get iMovie it might be a couple dollars on the app store I don't know but on my computer it's fucking free you can use whatever you have it doesn't matter cut it together nicely and that's it tip four make a bunch of different things you don't have to make just makeup tutorials just food just comedy I personally make parodies top tens makeup tutorials fart videos <laughs> I make a lot of shit. I like it. As long as you're happy with what's on your channel, make it. Tip five, how to make money on YouTube. So basically a lot of people use the ad revenue, which I also do, but it isn't enough money to live off of for me personally. It isn't enough. So my favorite way to make money is famebit.com. Famebit is an amazing website. Y'all don't even know I'm literally on it every day. It is the easiest way to connect brands to YouTubers so they can work together. And y'all, there's so many brands on this website. There's beauty, gaming tech so many different things I'm like yes and so basically all you need is 1,000 subscribers to join the actual website that's all you need click the link below down below I have put a link there so you just go to it you click join and then once you all joined in signed in all that stuff there's all these brands on the front page right like a fucking time. And so basically you just send proposals to all the brands that you are interested in working with. Tell them a bit about what your video plans are to promote their brands and then you send that off and if they accept you, then you make the video for them and then um, if they approve the video, you get paid. It is so like on point. It is a legit ass like way to make money. You get that moolah line, you know what I'm saying? Like I have done a couple famous jobs this month and I feel like my life has changed. It just slays me. Go check out the link below. There are new sponsorships added every single day and become a fame bidder. Tip six. Make good thumbnails. Basically, okay, thumbnails are like the reason people click on the video. Your thumbnails need to look interesting, but they still have to be accurate to what the video is. Do not do those misleading thumbnails. I hate that shit. Add a pop of color to your little screenshot or some shit. You know what I'm saying? Make it look good because then you're going to get more clicks. So thumbnails are a big part thing. I can't stress that enough. It's like as important as my anus hole, but like almost not really because my anus is like queen of the world. Tip six, make friends. It is amazing to make friends when you're like just starting off. You can help each other out, watch each other's videos, be supportive for each other as you're starting out. It's just amazing to find friends. You can find them on Twitter, Instagram. Speaking of that, my next tip, social media. Y'all, my hair, I can't. <laughs> I am obsessed with social media and it's always important to have a social media family, basically. So you have your Twitter, which is like your sister, and your Instagram, which is like your ugly aunt, but it posts nice ass pictures with all the Photoshop. Tumblr. 
Facebook. Join them all honestly. Like you can post your YouTube links on all of them. It'll help you make friends. It'll help you make fans. It'll help you do everything. Just spread all your shit on all your social medias. Just pretend all your social medias are toilet paper. And you wiping your shit on all your social medias. And your shit is your videos. Obviously I am the queen of metaphors. <laughs> Tip 9. Do not try to make your whole channel perfect. It's like no. Just have fun. You don't have to try to be perfect. If there's a blooper in your video. Keep it in the fucking video. People laugh at that shit. People like that shit. It makes you hashtag relatable. <laughs> no one likes a perfect ass bitch. I mean, but like if you naturally are like me, I guess it's fucking okay. <laughs> tip 10 is my last tip. Do not listen to hate comments. They don't mean shit. They don't, they don't even watch your fucking video. They just go to videos and just put random ass shit because they're fucking assholes. So many people get so discouraged from troll comments and like I have had, believe me, I've had so many troll comments, especially on my parodies, but it literally means nothing. So just ignore it, okay? Okay? You're fucking hot as fuck. Those are my top 10 tips. Now, someone give me a tip about my hair. I hope you guys enjoyed them. I hope you learned something. I was honestly doing like real serious tips for once. <laughs> and I feel like a fucking inspiration right now. <laughs> give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. It really helps me out. Oh, also another tip. Thumbs up people's videos. <laughs> don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Instagram. And don't forget to check out famebit.com. I love you guys so much. I'll see you next video. Oh, oh, oh. Fucking okay. <laughs>